Yeah, uh, guys. Um, just a twit sneaky Peter, an old um, old manor house just outside of Twins, but uh, um, I think it's worth having a look now before someone actually does something with it. Because it's just been sold as far as I know. But it's, I don't know much about it. All I know is it's called Upper Shibden Hall. Just sort of outside Queensbury before you get to Halifax. But um, yeah, I'll spin you around so you can have a look with me. I'm trying to be a little bit sneaky about this because um, there's a house next door. I'm not sure they'd be that impressed with me walking about having a snoop about here, to be honest. Oh, there it is. And you see, it's in um, rather a bad state. Uh, drop it onto this side. And certainly seen better days. I don't want someone to notice me. Not much better on the inside, neither. Yeah. I'm not going down there, because I probably won't be able to climb back up now in my look. Well, this is quite a tall tower. Um, well, the board looks a little bit precarious, but, <coughs> well, I don't know if that was even worth it. Nice put a cellar window down there. For some reason, I would point the camera up, but it won't let me. There's still panelling on that window. Oh, wow, the actual shutters are still on the window. I don't know if it'll let me show you. Oh, where zoom on this thing? I forgot where zoom is. You can just tell the panels are still on there. So just, uh, where's that off? There is a fireplace, isn't it? Oh, I don't like what on that piece of wood. See if I can go around the front, it might be a bit overdrawn now. Last time I had a look here, it was at winter time, so it weren't all that bad. But now it's much more overdrawn. And after one of the rooms, see if I can find some, um, some old pictures of the place, pictures of it in its hair there. Because I'm pretty sure it isn't. Hmm. Oh. Hello. Oh, not to know eat me, is it? <coughs> Sorry about that, guys. Just bumped into someone walking the dog. Told me about the place had burnt down some years ago. But it's a shame. I hadn't really had much done to it. That like fellow that owns it apparently has done some footings out to make the house a bit bigger. A few years back and just left it at that. Seems a bit, a bit of a waste of time, a bit of a shame. Ooh, oh, what an entrance. Wonder how far the gardens went down for this place then. Oh, one bone. Can't zoom out any further, this is the widest view I can get with this damn order. Oh yeah, gorgeous building, absolutely gorgeous. So that explains why it's in such a state. 
The owner had moved out, it left empty for a short while, and someone set fire to it. Seems to be what happens a lot around buildings in and around Bradford. It's been very well known for it. So I'm assuming I'd like a terrace garden running down here then. Yeah, there's a sort of terrace garden running down there. Yeah, these level, these bushes levelled off a bit. I'm a right massive view. What right on towards? Is it on towards Leeds? Maybe down there. Let's see how good a zoom is on this. Not great. You can just about tell. There's a big view down there. Should have brought my other camera with me early, but I didn't know I was going to be coming here. I was only supposed to be going for a little bit of a wander about. That tower's been engulfed by plants. Anyway, it's worth having a quick look or a quick film before it ends up on ground. Because it's not looking, it's looking a bit precarious. Anyway, I hope you all find it a little bit interesting at least. Bit of a pointless short video, so to watch while you're on the toilet, I suppose. Anyway, thanks for watching. Cheers. Bye bye.